Thank you, Jack. Your main weather today is brought to you by Refine Contractors. Refine your local expert in window and door installation, carpentry repairs, and commercial facility management. Give them a call today. Rise with Refine. All right, take a look at those highs out there today in Bangor. Got up to 73 degrees for our high in those low to mid 70s. Low 70s by the coast. Bar Harbor at 72. Rockland at 70. Lots of low to mid 70s to the southwestern portion of the state. And we got some cooler temperatures all the way up in the north part of the state. Presque Isle with a high of only 69 degrees today. So lots of upper 60s up there. For tonight, it is going to get cool again with those clear skies. And we'll have some calm, uh, calm winds as well. See Bangor right around 43 degrees for our low tonight. We can see by the coast a little bit warmer, but still in those upper 40s. Deer Isle at 49. Lots of low 40s off to the west as well. And then we got those mid to upper 40s down in the southwestern portion of the state where those temperatures are usually a little bit warmer. But overall, the state is going to be in those low to upper 40s and, uh, going into tonight. And then as we go into tomorrow, we'll be back up into those mid 70s here in Bangor, 74 degrees. Deer Isle in those upper 60s, still 68. And then up north, we're going to have those warm temperatures back. We can see Clayton Lake at 74 degrees, just like we will be in Bangor. All right, taking a look at that temperature trend, we can see into this weekend, it's still going to stay fairly warm, low to mid 70s. Saturday, a high of 72 and Sunday, a high of uh, 76. It is going to cool off a little bit going into Monday, though. We got a high of only 69 degrees and those temperatures will gradually warm up Tuesday, the Wednesday and Thursday back near 80 degrees with a high of 79. So it'll be warm yet again. All right, take a look at the humidity out there right now. Pretty good. We got dew points near those low 50s, but with that heat coming, we can see we are going to get some moisture back in the area. Dew points near those low to mid 60s. And then after that, we'll have a front that'll come through uh, Saturday into Sunday, wiping out all that humidity by Monday into Tuesday. Dew points will be back down by those low 50s. All right, take a look at the radar right now. We have lots of high pressure in the area, bringing uh, clockwise rotation, dry air, and no rain to really worry about for the next few days. Uh, looks like there is a system over way off to the west that we can't even see on the screen to the west of the Great Lakes over in uh, Minnesota and Wisconsin that will arrive to us by Saturday evening. Just bring in some nice heavy rain and uh, downpours possibly. Maybe thunderstorms, but it looks like for now that'll be out of the question. Uh, as we can see, for the next few days, nice and dry. Then we'll get some cloud cover going into Friday night, Saturday afternoon. Four o'clock is when we will start to see that rain and that front approach the state, bringing some heavy downpours across the state as well. Also, for tonight, low of 45 degrees, clear skies, patchy fog in those early morning hours, right around 3 a.m. and winds are going to stay light and variable. And for tomorrow, it's going to be nice and sunny out there. High of uh, 75 degrees in those mid-70s across the state. Winds from the south at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Taking a look at your extended forecast, we do have a front coming by Saturday, bringing rain chances. Highs only in those low 70s and will linger into Sunday as well. But high pressure will come back with temperatures in those upper 60s, low 70s on Monday and Tuesday. Beth and Peter.